Hello, I'm Dr. Shatnam Palvin, obstetrician and fertility consultant in reproductive medicine. On the occasion of World Prematurity Awareness Month, let me share with you some information about prematurity and its complications and how we can tackle the situation. Now, why are we talking about prematurity this much? Because prematurity right now in India is very common. One out of ten uh, births are preterm, and preterm babies are associated with a number of complications. So, what is preterm birth? Any baby who is born before 37 weeks of pregnancy is known as preterm, and those which are born before 30 week, 34 weeks of pregnancy are known as early preterm, which means 34 to 37, they are known as late preterm. Now earlier the delivery the more the chances of complications. Now what are the complications which may arise due to prematurity? First of all there may be breathing difficulty due to lung immaturity, feeding difficulty, increased chances of jaundice, uh, prematurity is associated with retinopathy, intracranial hemorrhage, increased chances of cerebral palsy, Later on in life, uh, there may be learning and behavioral disabilities. Also in adulthood, there is increased chances of cardiovascular disease like hypertension, diabetes, increased insulin resistance. So what do we do about it? First of all, any pregnancy may experience uh, preterm labor or pre-labor rupture of membranes. So first we need to know the risk factors. There are some uh, risk factors in which the chances of preterm labor is more. Like for example in patients who have experienced previous uh, preterm labor or uh, traumatic vaginal delivery previously or instrumentation of the cervix. In the present pregnancy if serial ultrasounds show a shortening of cervix or uh, there is a dilatation of cervix seen in the ultrasound then these are the predictors of preterm labor. In such cases, we usually give a prophylaxis of any form of progesterone or uh, a prophylactic uh, surclage which is basically tying of the cervix. Now there are certain maternal complications which may also give rise to preterm labor like hypertension, diabetes, twin pregnancy, simple things like uh, urinary tract infection, vaginal infection, lifestyle changes, extremes of weight, extremes of age, all of this are associated with preterm labor. Now how to tackle this situation? First of all, if there is a pre-labor rupture of membranes, we should definitely give an antibiotic prophylaxis. Uh, our main aim in case of preterm labor is to delay the pregnancy as much as possible so that uh, the other drugs are given a chance uh, to, for lung maturity and liver protection. So we use certain topolytic agents. Secondly, uh, we can also uh, for the lung maturity we give the mother corticosteroid injections. For uh, neuro protection we give magnesium sulfate injections. And also the last but not the least, the safe mode of delivery and also delivery in a well equipped center which is able to handle preterm birth. Uh, our main aim always is to continue the pregnancy till 39 weeks but always it's not possible due to certain maternal complications or fetal complications we may have to deliver prematurely and in such cases these precautions are very much necessary because ultimately we want a healthy mother and a healthy baby. So wishing all the expecting mothers and those who plan to conceive uh, recently uh, a very happy and very safe uh, journey through motherhood. Thank you.